हेलो एवरीवन आई एम फीडे इंस्ट्रक्टर एंड अरिना इंटरनेशनल मास्टर ऋषिकेश चौहान वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू प्ले सम फन गेम्स वी विल कम टू नो व्हाट आई मीन बाय फन गेम्स सो लेट्स स्टार्ट ओके वी आर वाइट ओवर हियर सो हियर द फन बिगिन्स Yeah, maybe he can give check. Oh, sorry, maybe he can give check from this diagonal. So we have to cover up that thing. So um, let's start d4. Okay. So both the players are playing all rubbish moves. I don't know what's wrong with this this guy. I know I am also playing all uh, um, silly moves, but uh, at least he can play with some sense. Okay, so let's consolidate our position. It's better to exchange the queens when your king is on that f2 all square. Yeah, good. It's good for us. So at least we won't uh, get checkmated very quickly now. so let's finish our development and maybe i'm thinking about playing h4 because there is nothing much left on this side okay first defend this pawn okay and then if we play h4 he can continue with um, this pawn push g4 okay uh, we have enough supports now we can play knight g3 okay let's move let's go ahead with the plan we'll try to keep this f3 pawn on this square so even if he captures uh, maybe pawn into uh, pawn we'll play pawn into pawn and this f3 square will give us uh, enough shelter for a white king so because of this f3 pawn there won't be any uh, knight checks coming up okay mm, what can we do let's i'm thinking about playing this but i don't know whether it will work or not because we are not uh, uh, threatening anything right what we can play uh, okay let's do one thing uh, i want to play knight f5 but right now this f5 square is gu guarded by the bishop so we'll try to remove this bishop by playing bishop c4 okay let's play i hope he captures because uh, if is not capturing then there is no point in capturing the bishop because then pawn will take uh, its place and we won't be able to play knight f5 after that so we are just hoping he captures or we'll have to find some plan b okay there is a plan b Uh, what I'm thinking, if he's not capturing, we'll capture, and then okay, he's capturing this thing. Okay, um, let's keep this center intact. So I was saying, if he's not capturing the bishop, we'll capture, and then maybe we can play a uh, knight c4, attacking this hanging pawn, and then knight uh, b6. Okay. i think this is good for us okay if we captures we have enough supports on this f3 pawn so we don't have to worry right now so let's develop our pieces or let's move our pieces on the better square Uh, here again uh, we can put our rook on this e file 
but I guess this, this G6 uh, sorry B6 square looks juicy even this knight f5 looks very nice he cannot castle because if he castles in this pawn will fall so we are going so far so good yeah that's good for us because then now we can uh, uh, remove our uh, double pawns okay Where is he going, by the way? Let's think for a while. I'm thinking about playing this, and then maybe, maybe he will play f6. Maybe we will give this check from e5. He will move his uh, king to f2, f7, sorry, and then we'll have to move again, right? Okay, right now we can cannot play this because otherwise this pawn uh, is uh, gone. The d4 pawn is weak. So we'll try to uh, do something with the pawn. Should we push it ahead? So let, let's, let's try pushing the pawn ahead. Because if he captures this b2, we are going to play rook b1 and then we are getting this b7 pawn. So I don't mind losing this pawn on b7, uh, b2, sorry. Okay, now he's going to capture the pawn. So we should do something. Maybe we can play this right. So that he cannot play bishop in 2b2 or else bishop d4 check and the bishop is lost. Yeah. That's what I was planning. So let's save this thing, right? It's better to save. This looks nice. Yeah, challenge him on the open file. Only one black rook is active. And here it goes. What if we go over here? Let's let me think. Maybe he will play rook into rook, rook into rook, and then can he attack? Yeah, he can attack, right? No, he can't attack. He can't come over here. We'll capture that pawn. Okay, this looks nice. Because we are going to give this check if he allows us. If he captures the rook, we'll simply recapture. Okay. We are again ready to give this check. Okay, rook on the 7th rank and here comes Bela. Hi Bela. Yeah. Is he going to give us, he is going to give this check, right? So, let us think, let us think, let us think. Mm, should we allow him a check? Slow. Let him give this check and we'll uh, run with the king on g3. We are short on time, so we have to play a bit quickly. Okay, 
let's kick this fellow first if he captures we are going to give this check sorry wrong arrow yeah okay that's good for us I hope I'm not missing anything over here, right? Okay, let's play this. There is no check coming up. And I guess we are getting that bishop for free, right? Okay. Ouch, he can play this. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Mm, but then maybe we can just start putting uh, more pressure on the bishop because bishop is pinned. He can play uh, rook f6. So that way he is going to attack both our weaknesses or both the hanging pieces. But then we will play rook into f8 check and then he will have to capture the uh, rook. And we are going to be a piece up. Ouch. Okay, good for us. This G2 pawn is a fighter. This G2 pawn is stopping all the possible checks. Good. Okay, where is he going by the way? Okay, let's give this check first. So I'm uh, trying to find some uh, free space for the uh, knight. Okay, now it looks good. Okay, now this guy is going to give this check, right? Okay, let's stop him. Mm, what is he planning? We are going to give this double attack and we'll pick up this knight. Of course, he will find it. It's not that difficult. Whenever there are very few pieces left on the board, it's very easy to calculate. It's difficult to find the plan, but it's easy to calculate with less pieces. So he should find that double attack. And he got this. Okay, but uh, we have this coming up, right? Yeah. And this check and the rook is lost. So he was so busy in saving the uh, knight that he lost the rook. And now he should resign. I guess a resignation is on its way. Yes. Yay and we won. And we uh, won this game with the ridiculous and or you can say hopeless and rubbish moves like f3 and king f2. So... Uh, this is a, just a fun game. Uh, of course, you must follow all the opening rules. We, you must follow uh, some opening principles. So, But uh, we are just having fun over here. That's why we, uh, I played f3 and then uh, king f2. So I hope you enjoyed this uh, wild battle. So till then, till the next time, see you. Thank you very much. Bye.